Alright everyone, welcome to the Civ 5 Let's Play, and this time round I'm going to be playing as Portugal in a probably very aggression orientated, again, probably going for domination or some kind of other victory that comes on the way on a mortal standard continent, standard speed, fairly normal, so let's just get this rolling. Blessings be upon you, most gracious Queen Maria, protector and sovereign of the Portuguese people. As the first ever Queen Regnant of Portugal, it was your wise stewardship that protected the royal court. Yep, that's enough of him. And right off the bat, let's have a look at Portugal. Um, we get the Fetoria. We will get luxuries of city-states. Uh, if we put these in their territory, which is very nice, although it comes a little late. Uh, so we won't benefit from that right away. And we get the now... So Caraval replacement gets an extra movement, and we can trade with city-states once, and that will give us quite a bit of money, around 270 gold if it's on the other side of the planet from where you are, from where your capital is, and um, we get extra money from resource diversity for our trade routes, so that's nice. So we're on the coast, we want to be on the coast, definitely. Oh. Hmm. Another fish there, although I don't want to settle there, or do I? If I settle there, I'll get four fish, wheat, incense, and wine, as well as um, four hills for production. Down here, it looks like there's desert. I don't know if there's a river there eventually or not, so I don't know, maybe there... There might be some good stuff down here, but you know what? I think we'll just settle on the incense. I'd rather have four fish. I want this city to grow really, really good. Like, I want it to be... Wait, uh, we'll get calendar, since that will instantly connect this incense up, and we'll try and trade our way right away, and then we'll connect these things up. It's just that, I I don't know, I, there's, de there's a possibility of this all being useless desert land, so... It's a gamble, but we'll go for it. Settling on resources isn't always the best idea, but sometimes, hey, you just gotta do it. Uh, scout. Production focus to get that little exploit or trick going, since at the beginning of the turn, production is calculated, and at the end of the turn, food is calculated. So when your city grows, it will automatically assign it to this hill, or the, whatever is the most production apply that to it, and then you can manually change it and get the benefits of the next nearest food tile as well. Okay, we'll go for that. Ancient Ruin. And we can see a mountain. Okay. Hopefully we don't, don't get beaten to it. Uh, we get better equipment. That's not bad. That's not bad. Now he's a bit more durable. Go here. Looks like there's a mountain range here. We'll just go south. Okay, city-state. Want to be meeting those early on. Pretty quickly. We're the first one to meet it. We got 30 gold out of that. Oh, it looks like this is probably the top of the continent, but we could be wrong. Okay, we moved away from... We still can't see much new stuff. Now we are going to be going Tradition. I like going Tradition, completing that, and then opening Commerce for Big Ben. I just I just really like that, as well as going down here for extra. Purchasing, in, purchasing items in cities requires 25% less gold. So combine that with Big Ben and um, it's, it's really nice. I just like doing that. Since we'll be getting a lot of money through trade routes because of our bonus, uh, uh, civilizations trait, and then we'll go rationalism, but then I want to just go autocracy. I like going autocracy, it's my most favourite uh, ideology. Now, we are going tradition, but I think I'm going to build the monument as well. We'll get a free amphitheatre, so that tra um, that policy will not be wasted. We will get eventually get some free building. Um, yeah, let's just go down here. Okay, we'll probably just kill that and then hope 
hopefully Prague will spit out a worker that we'll steal. I always steal workers. We're evil like that. Okay, yeah, it's, it's just desert land. It wasn't that great, so getting that extra fish is probably going to be beneficial to us. It's We moved away from that incense, but that doesn't matter. We can probably slap down a city around here somewhere. Let's have a look. Yeah, there's truffles here, so maybe... I like s settling cities on hills, but uh, maybe we could slap down a city there. It'd get the incense, it'd get the truffles, it'd have two wheat in range, it'd have loads of farmable tiles, as well as just some sheep. Uh, um, okay, we've grown. We'll select that tile. Probably want to get a lighthouse in here pretty soon to aid that growth. And next turn. Oh, we've grown again. That's kind of nice. But uh, well, our tiles that we currently that we currently can use aren't exactly the best. Just two food tiles. Hmm, this are we on our own little island here or something? Got a natural wonder here, although it's not the best of wonders. The, these North American wonders are a bit meh. Two gold, three... I mean, three gold, two hammers. Not bad. It's much better if you're... Spain, of course. Okay, there's another city-state. Maybe I wanna... I don't know if I should buy another scalp. Maybe we're just... connected to a larger landmass, but... I know, we're the first to discover that as well. Okay, that's looking a little bit, a little bit more like we're the only ones here. There's another city-state. Now, what do we want? Worker? Scout? Scout or worker? I'm pretty sure this is a dead end, so our scout will go that way. Once we've got our worker from Prague, we'll send him north. And if this is like the connection to the mainland, that would be really good. Just a ton of mountains and hills to defend ourselves. We're the first one to discover this one as well. Okay, so it does extend a little south, but that should be the extent of that. Oh. We'll just sand on a hill. 266 gold. Might want to buy that. I'm not sure. We can probably skip archery then, because we seem to be pretty lonely. Yeah. Although I would like to get optics fairly soon. But. Um, I could chop those. We could get mining. Probably will. Uh, actually, no. There is a lot of plains around here. Oh, no, it's grassland. Grassland, grassland, grassland. We could probably pray that there's some horses there, but since we started there, probably not. I'm not sure. Whatever you spawn to begin with usually does not have any uh, resources. Since we, of course, moved our capital. Okay, it goes further south, and this is now an archer, which is not bad. Truffles, copper. Okay, that's it. That, that's as far as it goes. Open tradition. Mm, yeah, that's probably city worthy. Maybe. Just to soak it up. Get two luxuries. You can place it on the hill there for extra production. It's not going to be an amazing city, but it'll be alright. Pretty far out, though. So, maybe not. Maybe, maybe. Right. What do we want? What do we want? I think I will just go for mining. We will, we will need it. Eventually. Have you got a worker yet? No? Hey, let's have a look. Let's just hop over there, even though we'll annoy them a little barging into their territory. 
the next policy. Legalism doesn't really do much since we've only got one city right now. And we've already built the monument. Don't have access to amphitheatres yet. And yeah, that's that's in the range of a uh, city state. There's, there's really no surprise there. <laughs> now, actually, let's uh, let's consider a few the few cities we can build. Incense grabbed by Prague. Although there's a high chance that this will be snapped up by Lisbon. Uh, your capital is pretty good at yeah. Lisbon's growing. Is pretty good at um, extending four tiles out to get whatever is there is. It's done that a lot for me, at least. Now I could put a city there. I prefer a coastal city. We want a coastal city to feed Lisbon cargo ship food. I don't want to use caravans. Caravans are when you've got access to cargo ships, you should always use cargo ships, unless there's some kind of militaristic reason that you know you're getting all your cargo ships pillaged or something. <laughs> then yeah, maybe. But you should be going for cargo ships now. Um, let's just click next. My initial thoughts would be on that hill. I could farm these up for food and there's loads of production around here. And Wheat, fish, two truffles, cattle, marble. We're not going to get that. And religion? We are not going to be going for a religion. I usually, ever since Brave New World, I enjoy just ignoring it. Ah, there's the worker. Swipe. And that's all I'm going to do. I'm, I'm not going to sit there and steal more and more and more and more. That'll be enough. Yeah, we're at seven happiness because this incense under our capital is not connected because we have calendar. I'll just farm that up. I'm in no hurry to get these luxuries connected because we are pretty alone here. There's just no one around. Which uh, might be a little boring, but what can you do? Now, okay. I want this to be size 5 before we start building settlers. I might just go animal husbandry and let's see what's, what else there is out there. Just want to get Lisbon going. And we need to just pull this guy back and defend ourselves from that annoying barb that's headed our way. There he is already. You can just go in there. We'll just start beating up this barb camp. You keep firing. You keep escorting. You just wait there. We'll not chop that just yet. Okay, he's kind of decided to go this way. You go there. And you just stop eating him up. Kill that. Farm it. Okay. Bob Fret has been... Oh, and somebody wants that. Mm. I could wait until I get a bit more from my pledge to predict them, so that the bonus lasts a little longer. Oh no, okay, we're gonna have to... We're gonna have to... Uh, Grab that. I've got a rather aggressive neighbour. <laughs> Although I don't think he's the neighbour, he's just down he there somewhere. Down. Okay, he's only got three gold per turn, yeah, but you know right. what? I'm willing to sell that to him for three gold just Yeah, you know, because it's something. It's better than nothing. Rather than it's just sitting there. Get something out of it. Ouch. <laughs> Okay, landed elite. More food for our capital. We want this thing to grow. Okay, archery. It might come back to try and... No. He's scared. Okay, there's some horses. And oh, this is looking much better. Far side of the river. Not next to coast though.
near side of the river, this would still get us bananas, horse, spices, sheep, wheat, two wheat, truffles, cattle. Not bad at all. Although... Maybe I'll put it there. Or there. We'll see what else is here. Or how close Denmark is. Because I want a coastal city to easily feed Lisbon and I want it to be fairly safe. I don't want to have to you know, go all the way around the landmass to do that. So a city there and a city there would for now be very good. I, I know this is all like, oh my god, Petra. But I usually ignore wonders a lot. I don't really go for wonders at all. The only ones I ever get are the Oracle, because it's so easy to get that. If you you can pretty much, if you complete it, if you complete it before turn 108 or so, you're pretty much guaranteed to get it. Okay. He's dead. You connect that up. Granary's almost done. Two turns until we'll just stop pre building the caravan. Just to get those trade routes going, they're important. You just get on the hill. We'll wait until that grows to size five and then we'll build a little settler. You just keep defending this area. Great library is going, all the windows are going to disappear now. City has grown. Settler. I want those settlers out. We're on turn 40, we need our second expansion. Our first expansion, even. <laughs> now, research. Where is he, though? He doesn't seem too close. Oh no, he, there he is, right there. He's just been sitting there and he's gone honor. <laughs> That's not too reassuring. So settling a city there might not be the best of ideas anymore. Because of this psycho right there. He, he'll have berserkers pretty fast. They hurt. They're, they're dangerous. <laughs> now, construction will be a must fairly soon. Probably go writing and then construction. I need to get composites to defend myself against this this barbarian, this brute. Yeah, we'll need to be getting optics sometime soon. And then Lisbon will grow very, very rapidly. Some horses there. Yeah, he's terrible at scouting. He like, didn't find us for ages. And then there's still ancient ruins down here. What has he been doing? And is he gonna just go nuts on me or... or Genoa? No. He doesn't know where my capital is. He's just... Um... Don't waste time just killing that for an extra 25 gold. Maybe. Although another barbs are gonna spawn in the meantime. You get on the hill for some chopping down a forest. Yeah, let's get out of here. <laughs> We're leaving. Monarchy. Chop that. We'll probably build two archers after this just to get ourselves a bit of a defense force from barbarians and and other people. Demand sugar. People are getting pantheons. He's not getting a pantheon either. We'll be like the religionless island for a while. Okay, there's a barbarian camp there. 
Barbarian camps usually like to spawn on places where the where a potential city could be built. Like where the um Danish warrior what? Can't see it properly. No, I can. Uh, where it, the the AI likes to suggest building a city. It usually likes telling you to build uh, spawning one there. Okay, yeah, it's like saying, "Yeah, go here, amazing." Except there's a guy with a load of units and a who's got honor there. Alternatively, this. No, 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 there. That wouldn't get the marble. <laughs> Let's just get these archers rolling. Two turns. Not bad at all. We probably are going to go south. We're going to try and. Or maybe we'll do it. Maybe we'll be really reckless and just try to. Slap down a city there. He'll be infuriated at that, and it will probably be the game-ending dumb move that we'll be doing. But um, I suppose it'll liven this place up. But here you know, get another archer. He does have a great general, so he could instantly plop it down, but I don't think they use it right away like that. We're gonna do it. Next turn. And then we'll have two archers. We've got another archer here, because it got upgraded from an ancient ruin. That's That's great. Oh dear, <laughs> this is gonna get awkward. What turn is it? Mm. I think I will build a granary. I'm gonna get this thing going. I will buy my way to there. Oh, that's desert. Oops. Mm, that's not too useful, but it'll help growth. Don't get the production though. That you usually do with wheat. Not easy so familiar with. It's usually it's on planes, but not this time. Well, we've got a river to defend ourselves with. So if we get some walls in there and composite bowmen, then we'd be a little better off than without those. We'll continue building the caravan again for two turns. He's got a ton of truffles. We'll just stand there. We're just going to hope that he'll be too broke to really amass something decent. But this is the AI. They get lots of discounts and so on. You go down there, just scout the way. The city is pretty done for now. Uh, let's just farm up some stuff. Although I should be heading down here to sort this place out. You can just fortify. You're gonna need it. Maybe, maybe I can build a fort there or something. Yeah, it's just a whole ton of mountains. Probably gonna need a four, especially when berserkers come along. Oh god. Oh god. He's got composite bowmen. This is grown. I'm using that now, good get that granary going and he's built that really close. It does get the gems. Doesn't get the truffles though. 
He's instantly getting attacked by something. <laughs> He's not gonna lose that though, that's not gonna happen. You die. <laughs> okay, this place has been blocked off for us now. We we can just retreat. We can't ex we can't scout there. Then a city here. Definitely want to build a city down there. Try not to lose the archer that we just spent some time building. And oh, I forgot. Pre-build it, we built it completely. Um, do I want to trade with him? Do I want to trade with him? Is he going to attack me and then make my? It does have three science. I think I'm just going to do it. We're going to play a little risky here. And if that cargo, I mean, caravan blows up. I'm not too bothered. I'd rather have cargo ships. Get that science rolling. Okay. We're using both of those. That maybe we want to grow. Six turns, six turns, but it's stagnating now anyway, so Take the money. Okay. Heal up. You just wait there, because the settler's going to be coming your way. Ah. He'll die. One gold per turn, okay. I suppose we were hindering his ability to mass more units by taking his only three gold per turn right away. Okay, forget farming all these up. That, that's useless. Let's go. Improve this city. Use that. Aristocracy, although maybe I could have used the other policy for better defense, but uh, right now it doesn't look like he's. It he looks like he's barb hunting, which is good for us. Scatter his units all over the place. Because right now he's only got warriors. Maybe I'll hold off on that. I'll build another archer. And then head for philosophy. Need to get that. National College under turn 100 is the benchmark, the, the kind of ideal time to get it. Fortify. And you just. Uh, she could go meet him. <laughs> I don't want to accidentally run into a bob. More wonders being built. Barb's being annoying. Build that library and buy it in the other city that I'm making. That I'm going to be founding. You go there, you go there. You go there. There. Get that luxury connected up. Get a library in here. And then we'll go back to construction after philosophy. Oh, we'll get it right now, actually. And then go back to philosophy. We want to be really secure. Oh, I could have attacked that, I suppose. But no, I couldn't. Hidden away. Okay, is this the plot? Is this the spot? Yes it is. Well, that, it, we could just settle here. I could make this the food 
powered kind of specialist center where all my guilds go in. I'd be missing out on the cattle. There's fish there as well. Um, now you know what? I, I, I'll, I'll go on the hill. There's just no end to these bobs. Taking forever to get to get killed. Okay, we'll plop down this city and buy that ivory. Golden Age. Production. There's wheat here in range. That's very nice. You can start going over there. Defend that place up. You just go there, block his way. Head down to that city, we're probably going to need it. <laughs> um, our happiness is not too great. Maybe we'll just build a shrine, get our faith rolling a little. Okay, there's there's nothing but mountains here, there's, there's nothing behind it. Oh, that's okay. In oh. <laughs> he doesn't know where my city is, he can't covet it. I covet your lands. You just sit there. Turn 74. Seven turns until philosophy's done, that's not bad. Library. Almost complete in all cities. Everything's looking great. Just kill those barbs, get a bit of gold out of that. Porto's grown. Yeah, use all the special tiles, get that extra money and, and so rolling. But it's just me in Denmark. That's not too good. Maybe I should get a trireme. Hopefully we can access other landmasses without needing astronomy. That would be beneficial to us considering how much, how many uh, resources we're going to have, uh, luxuries even. Mm. Colosseum, we're going to need happiness. Yeah, there's nothing here. Unmet player lost its capital. Oh dear. So it is, it is just this. I'm not going to settle a city down there, not yet anyway, it's just so far away. This this area down here. But you know what, I think we're going to take a break here. See you in the next one.